<laughs> the game hasn't even started, and I'm already entertained. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the start of something awesome here on the second channel. Today marks episode one of Ark Survival. Now this game right here, I actually did try to record episode one of yesterday. And unfortunately, my microphone was set to 100, so it kind of ruined all the audio from it. But I'm not too mad because it was a less than favorable experience. I've done so much. I did so much! Oh, wait, no, you found me. Oh, no! So, yeah, for the first half an hour, I died back to back to this uh, thing called a Titan Boa. It's some kind of snake. It just kept on killing me. I couldn't get away. I was a massive noob, but now I'm glad that I have, you know, picked up a lot of things. I've watched a lot of Let's Plays, mainly Let's Plays on people that are just starting out and just getting the basics of things. I know how this game works now, and I'm very excited to get into it. So if you guys are pumped for potentially by daily Ark Survival, let me know. Let's try and shoot for 10,000 likes. I know this game has been requested since the start of time on my second channel, and I'm finally doing it for you guys. It did dominate the Twitter poll with 44% of the votes for the new game that we're going to play here. I'm excited. I hope you're excited. Let's get right into it. So these are the multipliers that I'm running with because I've heard that this game is more of a tribe game. And uh, that's another thing I want to say as well, that this mini series right here, it's going to be a solo pilot series, I guess you could say. Um, there's going to be about five episodes or maybe ten episodes long of me just learning the basics of Ark Survival. And then, hopefully when I get over to Texas, we're going to be starting an Ark Survival server with uh, myself, Vic, Rob, um, and a bunch of other guys, Jerome, a lot of other people, Choco I think is interested, just a bunch of awesome dudes on an ARC server, it's going to be really fun and I can't wait, and it uh, should be a lot of fun with the gang, so if you guys want to see that, I mean, we're going to need your support, just let the other guys know, they're all down, but we just need to get into it, and that's the thing with ARC, I have been scared of playing this game for the longest amount of time because it looks daunting, like look at all these multipliers, there's too many, I, I don't, I'm scared already and I haven't even started, but I, it just takes the time to learn it, so uh, these are the multipliers I'm running, uh, just to make it a smoother experience for me and let's get right into it. I can't wait to play the game. Okay now guys, so here we go just like any kind of RPG game we get to design our character. Now uh, when I was doing it yesterday I made him look goofy as hell so I might try to recreate that. I'm not too sure because when I was looking at it I was like I can't get into this game because my guy is too distracting. He looked he was deformed. I literally had like all of him like I had, I had like a small hip and then I had like a huge torso, like, like, what did I have? I had like a huge chest. Yeah, I had like a huge chest come out and everything. It was just, it didn't make sense. So I think I might kind of keep him just normal for now. I don't know how to give him a certain hairstyle, but you can change his hair color. Maybe he grows hair over time. I don't know. Uh, but I want to make the eye color blue. <laughs> Look at that. You can change the size of his eyebrows. <laughs> oh, wow. You can change his... His head width. Let's make him a square head. Look at that. He's literally got a square head. <laughs> See, look at that. Just things you can do like that. I've made his, like, arms really small, but his hands really big. So he just doesn't look... He looks deformed. We can make him, like, a slender man. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's make him goofy as hell, dude. <laughs> the game hasn't even started. And I'm already entertained. Okay, guys, I think our um, little character right here is ready for some adventuring. Let's uh, give him a name. Let's make sure we give him the name of Lachlan for sure. And uh, I think, I don't really know what region to spawn in. I'd like to spawn on a beach, uh, typically, but I, I like how we look right now. Let's go ahead and let's create this new survivor. Here we go. Oh my god, the graphics in the- Oh yes, we got the beach spawn! The graphics in this game are so beautiful, and I don't even have a good PC, so when I get over to Texas and get on Preston's PC, it is gonna be even better. But just look at the graphics! Oh, I understand why you guys wanted this for so long. So I've learned the basics of the controls. I'm not sure if it's reset. Yeah, I reset a couple of my uh, default controls. I tried to set the prone to, like, control, but it didn't seem to work for some reason. So the main aim of this game is to try and gather enough resources to try and build a house, tame some dinosaurs, don't get killed by dinosaurs, and just have, I guess, some fun at the same time. Now, we actually just leveled up by grabbing stone. I did not know you could do that. that. So we're at harvesting right now. I do have the multiplier set on, so it is easier for me, but uh, we actually
actually have leveled up. So for new people out there, leveling up, every time you level up, you get to increase some of your stats over here. So you got your movement speed, your crafting speed, health, stamina, oxygen, all that jazz. And uh, you actually learn crafting engrams as well. So I'm going to go ahead and up my health here just to make things cool. And then we learn some engrams. These are essentially your crafting recipes. You learn how to craft things. So starting out, I definitely want to learn how to get a campfire. Actually, no, we should be fine for now. Let's grab a stone hatchet. Stone hatchet sounds good. I swear you can get a stone pick and a spear. Let, let's learn the hatchet. Let's get the hatchet and let's get the spear so we can try and defend ourselves. Now, uh, Mr. Miola, who does a lot of arc on his channel, you guys may know him, I did the uh, scrap mechanic with him. He was trying to like give me a little bit of a lesson on how to play arc. And he was like, don't touch anything apart from dodo birds. And that's about it because everything else will kill you. Unless we get strong enough and get some levels, some weapons and whatnot. So we have, as you can see here, these are our craftables. We're going to try and aim for a stone pick to get things started. Um, so we need to get wood and thatch. So to get wood and thatch, we need to go ahead over to these trees and punch them. It's literally Minecraft, but better graphics. But it actually hurts you when you punch the trees. So kind of more realistic Minecraft and a, a way more beautiful Minecraft as well. So we're going to go ahead and craft this bad boy up over here and craft that item. So it takes a little while. You can up your crafting speed with your stats and we are getting our health back over time as well. Uh, now, of course, I am new to the game. So if you do have any tips out there in the comments, I would love to hear your uh, tips. I know for one thing I'm having trouble with uh, in my last time recording this. Oh, well, obviously I was dying a lot more last time, but uh, just trying to quickly equip items. If there's like a hotkey to quickly like hover over this and and equip it i don't really know if there is a hot key because that's that i hate dragging it every time anyway we're cold right now and we need to get a campfire can we mine this tree oh we can sick dude all right so we want to try and get a campfire going because we are actually like i said we're losing um well not losing oxygen but we're actually you know look at it look at our heart look, look at that little thing oh there's a dinosaur we want to avoid that now some of them are passive what if i told you that i could destroy this whole rock this whole huge boulder right here You'd call me a liar, wouldn't you? Well, get ready, because I'm about to blow your mind. Whoa, we got metal. Now, I didn't realize what metal was last uh, time I recorded this, and guess what? I still don't know. So, um, if anyone wants to tell me what metal's used for, probably for higher tier recipes, I would only assume, because I'm only getting one uh, at all. But it seems that the bigger the rock... Oh, I just... I just shat myself. See, look at that. I destroyed the whole rock. It does lag my game a lot when I do that, though. So, so yeah, when I was recording for the first time yesterday, I actually ate my own shit. And um, it killed me straight away. Uh, so don't eat your own shit is something I learned last episode. And uh, I was I was, um, I was was pooing inside my own house, which, go away, um, which was really just not on. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, it seems that you can, you can consume it, but you don't want to. I'm going to go ahead and uh, throw it away. There you go. L removed human feces. <laughs> you can use it for growing crops and whatnot, though. Um, but, yeah. Anyway, let's get things set up over here. I think it's a nice little place right here for getting things set up and good to go. So, um, I think we might make a torch as well. That'll give us some... Um, honestly, I think we should get a spear going. What do we need for a spear? We need some fiber and some wood. Okay, so wood is, of course, still in the trees. But to get fiber, you need to go ahead. Oh, look, look at me in first person. <laughs> Look at me! I am I'm trying to farm. Uh, but yeah, to get uh, some fiber, you go up to these plants over here and just just harvest from them. Really, like I'm getting so much fiber already. I mean, I do have those resource multipliers, and I didn't have them on last time, and it was so much harder without the resource multipliers. But like I said again, I am playing on my own, and I was getting destroyed. I, I, it was weird. Last time when I was playing, I spawned inside a, uh, a swamp, and it was just. It was, it was hell, dude. The Titan Boas. Oh, dude. I need revenge on those guys for sure. Um, but anyway, craftables. Uh, let's... No, we still don't have the engram for it. We need more wood to make the spear. So let's go ahead and smack this tree down. And just honestly, just get a bunch of resources and level ups. There we go. All right. So let's go ahead and put it on movement speed. And here is more of our engram points. So I'm going to go ahead and try to get a... Uh, foundation, wherever that may be. Here it is. Uh, learn that because that will give us the foundation. It's like straight out deep. You need the foundation before you can, you know, put the other pieces on, which I learned in last episode. And then we're going to go ahead and grab some walls. I think we're dying or something, so we should probably get out of here. Uh, and then I will... Uh, let's... It requires ingram... Oh, so I actually have to learn the door frame to learn that one. So I'll learn the door frame, and now I'm going to need more engram points. I'm going to need more XP to level up before I can do that again. Oh, we are hungry! 
Okay, we are hungry, so we're going to need to eat some of those berries that we just found. Otherwise, we are going to get in trouble. There we go, we've lost that hunger debuff. Just eat them all up. Uh, some of them have uh, negative and positive things. Most of them can be used for dye. Its juice improves almost every meal, but we don't have a meal. Uh, yeah, see, look, white dye, uh, can be used to make black dye. Uh, how can I not poo? And does anybody know for an easy way for me to get rid of poo? Because I don't like picking it up and then... Oh, actually, I guess it's in my hotbar. I might as well just... Yeah, pick it up and throw it away. Ah, uh, you're starving. Finally, so look at this, dude. It's it's a really hard game to keep on top of with your berries. I'm just gonna go ahead and eat all of them right now because we are uh, really struggling for food and we can't really kill anything just yet. Is that is there something else there? No, it's like some hat skins or whatnot. I have no idea what they are. Um, but yeah, eat, 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 eat. <laughs> Now, I don't know how to tame. I don't know how to tame at all. So, we're not going to be taming at all. Not a chance. Not a chance for taming. Um, anyway, uh, let's go ahead and see if we can make that foundation at all. Uh, we can't make the spear yet, but we can make the foundation. Because I do want to get inside and have my own little place to, um, to yeah, pretty much just be safe. Because I don't like having not safe places, if that makes sense. It probably does. Alright, so let's put the foundation. I wanted to try and be as level as possible last time. It wasn't level and it was really annoying. So, let's try and have it like about... I uh, can't get it, like, in the ground, like, stranded deep, kind of. I'll put it right there. And we can expand it out and whatnot. So, there we go. Uh, here's our place. Uh, let me just get some of these fibers away from here. Uh, we need more fibers anyway. Come on, give me some more fibers, please. Fibers for me. 21 fibers in one, dude. That's crazy. All right, so the sun is going down. Predators do come out at night, I think. So, we need to get this wall going quick. The daytime goes so quick in this game. It's actually kind of frustrating. We are really low on wood, so let's get some more of this wood. I'm pretty sure if we build a hatchet, we'll get wood uh, more often than thatch from trees. Trees. But honestly, look at that. We got five wood from that tree alone. That's not too bad. Um, let's go ahead and get our stuff going. When you die in this game, you lose pretty much everything. So that was one thing I was asking people last episode is how to like try and keep your spawn um, you know, safe so that you won't... Oh, I can craft all two. Yeah, let's craft more of those things. Hey, how do I keep my spawn, like, safe in a sense so that every time I respawn, I can spawn back on my bed? I don't know if it's like Minecraft that allows you to do that, but if it does, that would be really cool. Alright, so we're actually leveling up here from crafting, which is pretty lit. Uh, so let's go ahead and put all these walls down. We don't have enough of that roof just yet. And we are still cold, so we're probably losing a bunch of things. We need to get that fire going. So let's go ahead over here and let's actually increase our food. Oh, that just increases our top food. I don't know if it increases our use of the food. Dang it. All right, so let's go ahead learn the ingram for the roof and learn the ingram for the door. Uh, and then I guess we'll learn uh, the campfire as well. Yes, the campfire is crucial. Okay, so actually, we're off to a fire start, honestly. And time just flies. I can't believe we're actually... Um, this far into the episode because I am just having so much fun. Let's eat some berries and um, Okay, I guess it wants us to eat at the same time uh, Now let's see what do we, can we craft more of these bad boys? We can craft the door, but we need the door frame first and we need more wood to do just that Can we make that hatchet by any chance? We really need to get that hatchet going. Yeah, let's craft it What does it say? Uh, sharp flint hatchet for harvesting wood from trees. Yeah, stone from rocks and skin from bodies Yeah I don't know if it is actually more efficient at getting actual better resources of wood than thatch, but we'll find out. And I'm really hoping that a raptor does not come out and eat me. I don't know how we're doing this well, guys. Like, I can't stress to you how bad yesterday's experience of uh, this game was. It was a nightmare. 66 wood. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and assume that this gives much better drops. All right, I just want to close this up before we uh, get a little too comfortable here. So let's go ahead and make a door frame. And let's go ahead and craft a door. And let's craft a campfire as well to get those um, cool things going. So let's go ahead and put the door frame in here. The door there. And that campfire, last piece coming through. There we go. Now we still don't have anything to cook with, which is kind of annoying, but it's fine. All right, let's chuck the door here. Let's chuck the door frame there. Oh, and the roof. Let's get that roof building, dude. Uh, let's go ahead. We have so many resources right now. It's actually crazy. With that multiplier, it makes things a lot easier. Uh, and I think we're about to level up as well. Yeah, we got like 4 XP for crafting things. That's pretty lit. Uh, thatch roof. Let's go ahead and chuck this bad boy down right. You gotta like, have it perfect. Alright, we can't... Okay, I think we're gonna go outside. Let's go outside here. Let's open the door. And perfect. There we go. And shut that door. And now we can't see anything. But don't worry, guys. We will be able to see something soon. Now, last episode, I was worried that I would, um... <laughs> I would actually burn this thing up. But it's fine. It doesn't burn. I don't think you can cook berries, though. So, uh, let's go ahead and light the fire. And now we can see again. Alrighty. So... Um, now, it didn't burn down last episode, so if it burns down in today's episode, that's news to me. So we only have berries to eat right now, so let's just go ahead and just 
just eat all the berries real quick. Eat them all. Eat them all. And, oh, just, that noise just like... Feels good. Yeah, you're meant to be eat these with... Oh, we crashed. Oh, no, we didn't crash. You're meant to eat these berries with a meal, but I don't do that because I'm a little bit of a... Nah, I don't know. I don't have the food. I would love to find some dodo birds. I'd love to get that spear going and try to actually hunt some things down. Oh, level up. Let's go. Um, Can we do for... Yeah, we can do melee damage. Let's go for a little bit on that. And uh, we've learned some more in grand points. So first off, like, I was really enjoying this game yesterday. I'm still enjoying it. Obviously, I'm off to a much better start this uh, <laughs> episode one than I was yesterday. Um, but uh, let's see what should we learn here. Simple bed. I do like that. Yeah, it requires a uh, hide sleeping bag. Okay, so we have to learn the sleeping bag for that. Uh, storage boxes, simple beds, simple YouTubers, uh, saddles. Okay, okay, okay. Let's let's leave that for now. Let's leave it alone for now. Let's not, let's not touch any of that. Okay, so let's go outside. Let's get our torch going. Let's equip our torch. Uh, where is our torch? There it is. So, how do I get the torch to work? There we go. That's how it works. So just equip it. You're cold. You should find some wards. Dude, I'm holding a torch though. I mean, how do, can I put it down? Oh, you can't put it down like that. And it doesn't actually... That's kind of annoying. It's kind of annoying indeed. So we can't adventure out because we're too cold because we don't have any um, armor, I guess you could say. And we haven't learnt any armor yet either. So we're either going to... Oh, I wish you could make some windows, man. I don't know if like later on you can make some uh, materials that have windows because I, I need some windows badly. Um, but for now, I'm just nice and, and cuddly inside my dirt. Oh, you can actually lock your doors too. That's kind of insane. Um, so let's see what's out here. We're cold. It's fine. Uh, we need to get some foods. So let's see. I see some things. I don't see anything actually. It's kind of crazy and bizarre. Now, I still don't really know what these big things in the sky are. They're like supply drops, and you need, like, a certain level or something to get them. Is that a dinosaur? No, it's not. Now, I really don't want to explore the, the seas because I saw, like, a bunch of really crazy shit last episode, and I don't want to explore that kind of stuff. But I will see what's going on. Oh, actually, can I make that bed? I'd love to make that bed and then go to to bed. <laughs> oh, don't tell me that smoke is burning it down. I would really get pissed off. In fact, I'm going to turn it off. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, uh, but now I'm cold again. Dang it. Um, can I put this on a wall somewhere? Oh, I guess I can do that, but that, like, kind of burns my eyes. Let's not do that. Let's not do that, please. Alright. Oh, but then, where's the, where'd the fire go? There it is. Okay, good. Um, I'll take the screw. Let's leave the lid on. Um, but, at the same time, we need to get this bed going. We don't have enough space to put a bed down, though. Uh, what do we need for our hide sleeping bag? We need hide, which we have none of currently. So we're going to need to do some leveling up uh, in grand points to apply it. Because we want to get this simple bed. Um, but we need another level to get that, essentially. So, let's go out. Let's do some grinding. Uh, what resources are we actually low on right now? We have no thatch. because Oh, we actually do some thatch. Fibers. We need some fibers. And we need some... Oh, I guess we don't really need some stone. There's nothing really required for the stone. Let's just get some fibers and whatnot. Let's just get some, let's get some fibers. And a bunch of berries that we don't need. Okay, so I've been farming for a bit. We mustn't be far off our level now. Oh, wow, the levels get much harder, it seems. Wait, is that 7.9? 79 out of 100, but it doesn't look like it's going up at all. That's crazy. So, yeah, we learn XP over time. I, I don't understand. This is really hard to get levels, man. And just like Minecraft, I hate nighttime more than anybody else. Like, it's just so annoying. You're just there for so long. It's just like, dude, you've, you're, you've, you're encumbered. Drop some inventory weight in order to move again. Oh, damn. Let's eat some. We have to eat some of these berries, dude. Can we eat too much berries? We're about to find out. Uh, so it tells you their weight as well. Uh, what's the seeds for? Uh, eat it to gain a tiny amount of nourishment or plant it to grow your own Alzari bush. Can be planted in small, medium, or large... Okay, so note to self, do not eat too many berries. Am I dead? What happened? But, dude, we only ate too many... Okay, so I think today I've learned do not eat too many berries. <sighs> what the f fudge was that? I don't understand. Maybe it was at the weight? I, I don't understand. <laughs> Alright, let me... Okay, I don't want to eat the berries in case that was the berries. You know, like, I don't know if it was the weight or what. But too many berries. Oh, I can actually use that to craft another one. That's actually pretty cool. Alright, that's cool. Um, I'm going to eat more berries. I hope that eating more will not... Do you pass out from, like, a food coma or something? We're still encumbered, though. We have to get rid of some of this stuff. All right, there's all of my stuff right Actually, it doesn't, it actually doesn't matter to drop all of my stuff in here. I mean, we're only going to craft with the stuff in here as well. Uh, so let's drop all items. 
I sure want to drop all of your items, except... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, shit. I don't understand. How did I break my boot? <gasps> what the fuck? I punched my own house and killed myself. How did that happen? Okay, so... We are back. Oh, there's my place. I can see the fire. Okay, okay, okay. We're not too far away from where we were. That was the biggest problem I had last time, was trying to find my old place. But I am a little concerned that we dropped everything in our inventory and have lost things. Because if I did do that, it's a minor setback, but I thought it would drop it all on the ground. Here, let me just... What? Oh, don't... For... Why is... I think I put the player damage the wrong way around so that whenever I take damage, I take so much damage. Alright, wait up. Was there... Alright, I'll take your hatchet, your torch. I can't believe that. Uh, can I get rid of you, dude? Can I eat you, actually? Can, can, wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second! Oh my god. We can literally be a cannibal and eat ourselves. Alright, well, we've lost pretty much all of our resources, so... We tried to punch our own house, and we nearly killed ourselves. I'm just checking to see if the items dropped underneath our house. No, they did not. Uh, I think I'm going to change that player damage one, because it looks like we're taking damage at a ridiculous rate. Um, but let's, uh, let's get some, some, some resources because we lost it all. <laughs> oh, look, there's a bag on top. Is this all my stuff? Well, I think I dropped everything on top. Access inventory. Better grab these items before they're gone. Mm, looks like everything else left. It looks like that fiber on the ground despawned as well. All right, I am new to dropping items and, uh, I will probably never stop breaking the friggin' house. Oh, I just, like, <laughs> I put a... I, put to, I don't want to burn the house, please. I can actually cook that meat now as well. Um, so let's see here. Go ahead, access inventory. If I chuck this raw meat, which I actually got from myself, I can eat it and eat myself. <gasps> Holy crap, what a grim day today has been. You know, there, I have not seen a single dinosaur, which I'm very happy about. I've just known that next time I load in this game, I'm going to edit those multiply. Did I, is that something? You're level three. I wonder. What? Run away! You're cold, you're cold. Find some more. Okay, we are running out of fibers, so let's grab some fibers. We need some of this stuff badly. We're getting too many berries, though. Like, I really should just drop these as I get them. Like, it's crazy. Oh, look at that, guys. The sun is rising. Ooh, hello, sun. So beautiful, man. So beautiful. Starving. Find something to eat fast. Berries! Let's go! Wait up, wait up, wait up, wait up, wait up. Did we run out of wood or something over here? Thatch. Let's get that stuff cooking, dude. Holy damn. I've got some meat in there, though, to eat now. We should actually... Oh, don't undo the fire. Uh, access inventory. Let's take some of this cooked meat. And let's go ahead and let's eat this bad stuff. Uh, so let's eat a berry that goes well with it. And let's eat some of the steak as well. And let's eat another one. That should raise my hunger up something serious. Two cooked steets, uh, steets, steaks. And not just any steak. My own steak as well. I just wish I could get some clothes on so I could actually go outside without this warmth indicator. Like, that's the most frustrating thing. Is this that level 2 dinosaur? Because if it is... Alright, dude. I'm sorry. I'm going to give you a run for your money. Let's go! Let's go! Oh, wow! We killed him! I have killed a dinosaur. I am very sorry. But not actually. Oh, that is disgusting. And there's nothing else I can really do apart from gather the resource from it. So I'll get the hides. Uh, let's use this to get some hides, actually. Yeah, I get more hides with this stuff. 20, 25 to get a... Uh, oh, wow, this thing has a lot of resources. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I think we get XP for killing it as well. So you can see just all the land that I've taken away from this place. All right, that's good. That's good. I like that. So I got more meat to cook. And, um... Oh, my God, have we got meat to cook. Boys, have we got meat to cook. Uh, let's chuck some wood in here. We have way too much wood on us right now. I don't know how to take, like, half the stack in there. You know what I mean? Like, how Minecraft, they can, like take some of it out so anyway light the fire and that's gonna be cooking up an absolute storm we'll have food for days thanks to that little dinosaur bless up i uh, appreciate what you've done for us today you are amazing uh, and i don't think we have any levels which is kind of annoying we nearly have a level we need to get a level before we wrap up today's episode because i want to get the uh ingrams to sleep or i might even grab the ones to craft some uh yeah no i'll get the ingrams to sleep all right let's uh what resources are we missing out on right now we have no stones so uh, let's go ahead and wreck down a boulder. This one right here looks perfect. I'm just getting flint. We're not getting any stone. It's kind of annoying. Will I get more stone with this one? Yeah, I get more stone with a hatchet because it's not for finding flint. So I only get stone. It's actually perfect. But I think it uses more durability maybe like Minecraft? I'm not sure. I guess I lost those metals as well, which is kind of annoying. There we go. Big stone destroyed. 
Oh boys, the graphics, the graphics. <laughs> so I can repair with E and that will repair the place that has been damaged, which was when I hit it with my own hands. <laughs> Can I repair the floor as well? Yeah, repair the floor. Anything else need repairing? No, everything else is good. That's because I hit it with my own fist. <laughs> the door actually needs repairing as well. There we go. Okay, it is morning. What is going on out here in the morning? Who is here and who wants to party? Oh, water is the other thing I need to ask, guys. I don't know how to get water unless I naturally get them from berries. Oh, you may have a potential predator here. What level is he? What are you? Level one. Oh! Oh, what? 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 Okay, we killed one, but I gotta watch out because I'm blind for like five seconds. He sprayed me right in the eyes and it's raining! Rain, clear my eyes, please! Alright, what the hell was that, dude? Oh, sh shit. We're so dead. Run, we can't run. Oh, we've broken our bones. Fight! Oh, thank god we fight! Oh, no! No! We, it was like fight or flight and we... Flighted and then fighted. Good, good, good words, Lachlan. Okay, we have to try and find our old house now, which we have no idea where it is. Oh no! Hello, big dinosaur. Oh, here's my map. Okay, I didn't know we had one. All right, so which way am I facing? It doesn't tell me. Um, I'm trying to find like where am I right now? I have no idea. Like, what if we're on the wrong side of the island? You know, like we're burned. Okay, guys, I think bad things have happened. We've lost our house and we have no way of getting home that I know of. Aerodactyl, will you please? Oh, not Aerodactyl. Pterodactyl. Will you please take me home to my land? I need to find my people. And my people is my things. Oh, no. All right, let's pick a fight with some of these guys over here. Let's go. Oh, you little, little. Oh, yeah, get wrecked, dude. You want to fight? You still want to fight, dude? Yeah, let's fight. Oh, wow. We got killed by a little incy wincy one. Oh, shit. It's one of those titan boas. Run. <laughs> run, 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 run. Now, I'm not sure if it's like you're hot. You should find some place to cool down. What? It's raining, dude. How the hell would I be hot? It is raining. Oh, there is that snake. And he is. Oh, can I say? You see, this is the thing that happened last time. I just spawned in a place with a bunch of Titan Boas. And they killed me. You see, the thing is, I really don't want to waste my time that I have as the sunlight is still up. I'm just trying to find where I was with my house. This is the biggest problem I had before, but I, I'm, I'm learning more about how it works. I just, I want to find my bed that I didn't make. Oh, some dodo birds. I'll bring you home. I will bring you home. Jump over the dinosaur. <laughs> Parkour. Parkour. Oh no, you're tired. Stop moving for a moment to regain your supply. Don't chase me, please. I need to find home, please. He is still chasing me. Holy sh- Oh, there's a pterodactyl. Wait, how do we level up? I don't remember leveling up. Alrighty, guys. Well, I cannot find my own home. Very sad indeed. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up right there. I hope you guys did go in to enjoy episode one of Ark. I'm going to try and find my house off screen because it seems it's going to be quite a tedious process to do so. But hopefully, like I said, you did enjoy the first episode of the series. I cannot wait to get right into this thing and uh, just do a bunch of episodes on this awesome game. If you guys are just excited, let me know and I will see you guys next time. Later, guys.